All right, welcome back to Kirby Days, and today we're going to do a full playthrough of Stone Age, which is a super duper simple worker placement game with a lot of luck because you are rolling dice to get uh, resources. So this is very simple. I don't even need to do a rules video for this one. Uh, pretty straightforward, pretty much entry level. So this is going to be a three player game. As you can see, I'm going to be red playing against green and yellow. Uh, the only changes between a uh, four and a three player game is uh, for the middle three spots here. Uh, the love hut, the uh, farmhouse, and the uh, tool maker here. Uh, you're only allowed to use two out of three every round. In a four-player game, you can use them all. And uh, we're only going to be using three of these uh, four stacks of buildings because this is the game end timer. And before I forget, uh, only two players can be in every single resource region except for obviously the hunting. All right, so oops, forgot to put out the cards. Two, three and four all right so red's gonna be first player which is gonna be me and let's get started and i'll show you how this works all right so typical worker placement wherever you see these circles is where you can put a worker now the way the game works is it works in three phases first phase is everyone's putting out their workers so you're not collecting anything right away second phase you're going to collect your workers in turn order and activate them in any order that you like so obviously you want to get the resources before you use them to either get cards or build buildings all right, and then third, you have to feed your people. So yes, every single round you need to feed your people. And that's why you have to go hunting here where unlimited amount of people can go to get some food. Once you've done all that, that's the end of the round. You're going to go to the next round, refill, pass the first player marker. And you can just keep going until one of these three um, building stacks is empty or we completely dry out the deck of civilization cards. All right, so those are pretty much all the rules. All right, so red's going to go first. And let's put out some workers. So... Um, not sure what i want to do just yet obviously i want to go to one of these middle three spots because very limited in a three-player game only two out of three can be used so i can either go to love hut and generate another worker which is great in a worker placement game or i can go here to raise my farm value here uh so that i don't have to pay as much food every round for my worker so you know what um i think to start off let's uh let's go here all right so again first phase you're putting out your workers you're not going to gain any benefits for them right away all right, so there was that. So green's going to be second player. And where do they want to go? I think they're going to go for the uh, the whole love hut extra worker thing. So they're going to go here. All right, now it's going to be yellow's turn. Now, again, three-player game. Yellow can't go to the toolmaker because we're using two out of the three spots. So what do they want to do? They're looking around, looking around. We don't start with any resources. We just start with food. So um, to get any civilization card, you just have to turn in the amount of resources as indicated above here. So any resource to get this card, any two resources to get this, so on and so on. Um, so what do they want to do? Now, I mean, none of these cards are really exciting. They're for the symbols. Uh, symbols are just end game scoring stuff. What you get on top is basically if you turn in three resources, you get two. If you turn in two, you get some five food. Turn in one, you'll score. Uh, sorry, you get two food. Um, you know what they're going to do? They're going to try to stack up on a bunch of wood so that next turn they can come out here and get a bunch of cards. So what they're going to do is they're going to get four of their guys and send four guys out here into the forest to gather some wood. And I'll show you how that works later. All right, so that was yellow's turn. So now it's going to circle back to red. And what red is going to do is they're going to fill up the last three spots. So as you can see here, there's seven spots in each of those regions. To place workers first come first serve so yellow put four so red is stuck putting only three so that's that all right then we're going to go to green who's got two guys left uh, three guys left and uh, i guess they're going to let's see they're not going to have any resources for cards neither for building i think they're just going to send their three out here into the uh the hunting grounds to get some food to pay for their workers all right plus they're going to have an extra worker to pay every single round all right, yellow has one guy left. He's gonna go hunt. Red's got one guy left. He's gonna go hunt. And there you go. Everyone's placed their workers. That's the end of phase one. Pretty simple. All right, now we're gonna do phase two. Like I mentioned, everyone's gonna activate their guys. But you do this in turn order and you activate all your guys. All right, so let's start off with the first player, which is red. I'm gonna go to the farmhouse here, which is gonna raise my farm value here. Now, again, like I mentioned, the higher you are here, the less you're gonna have to pay for your workers at the end of the round. All right. So that's going to be their first guy. And you, they just keep going until they have no more guys on the board. All right, now I'm going to pull from uh, the wood. All right, so this is going to be three. Now for these guys, all right, the resources, it's not going to be like most worker placement game where you, for every guy you send, you're going to get one resource. Uh, this is where the dice come into play. 
<laughs> okay. Now, for each guy that you send, that's how many dice you're going to roll. All right. And the amount of resources you're going to get is dependent on the type. All right. So for food, you divide the value by two. Wood is three. Uh, brick is four. Stone is five. And gold is six. So I'm going to be dividing by three. All right. So hopefully I get at least a nine. Let's see. So it's going to be nine. So it's going to be 14. That's awesome. So that's a great roll. So 14 divided by three. So that's going to be four wood. So I just made four wood right there. I'm going to put this in my supply. All right. Um, and then I still have one guy left. So I'm going to go for a hunt here. So there's only one guy. So I only roll one. But this is divided by two. So I should get at least one. And I rolled a one. So that's going to be nothing. No food for me. <laughs> All right. Which is fine. All right. There you go. That's completely Red's turn in phase two. So now we're going to go in turn order again. So uh, green's going to generate a new worker. Boom. Just like that. Uh, next, their only other option is right here. Roll three dice for your uh, food. So this is going to be divided by two. So it's going to be eight, 11. So they just made five food. Let's give them five food. Pay for the guys this round. And there you go. They're done. <laughs> All right. And then yellow is going to go. Pretty simple for them. They're going to roll one die for food divided by two. Again, nothing. That's a shame on them. And then four for the wood. One, two, three, four. And this is divided by three. And this is going to be 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So it's going to be four wood exactly like I did. Right. Boom. And there you go. That was phase two. All right. All the workers are done. Phase two is over. We've got a phase three, which is pay food for your workers. All right. So now I have, I'm just going to show you this one time, uh, five workers in my possession, but I generate one free food every turn. So you can either take it and then pay for it. What I like to do is just minus it from what you need to pay. So I do need to pay five minus one. So it's going to be four. So I'm going to get rid of five and take back a one. And right, now each player is going to do this. Uh, now green has an extra worker. So they have to pay six actually, and they get no discount. So it's going to be six. And then yellow has five guys, no discount again. So they're just going to pay five. And there you go. We finished the first round of the game. All right, you're going to refresh. You're going to untap your tools if you had any. Uh, pass the first player marker over. Um, the tools we'll get into later. These are how you do dice mitigation for every tool that you tap. You're going to add plus one to your die roll, stuff like that. Like if I rolled a one for food, I can tap a tool. Make it a two, at least get one food uh, back. All right, but there you go. That was the first round of the game. All right, so round two. Uh, green's going to be first player this time and because they have extra workers I guess they're going to come over here into the farm area to get uh, a discount on the food that they have to pay it's going to be a good move for them and now yellow's going to go uh, where do they want to go I think they're going to go for tools or do they go for the extra worker you know what extra worker is always good it's a worker placement game they're going to go for the extra worker All right, which leaves a red so what does red want to do um I think what I'm going to do is go for one of these cards. I mean, this one I can use one resource to get two food, two resources to get five. So this is a better return. But you do also want to look at the cards and what benefit they give you for end game scoring. So the top part is what you'll get every single time you get the card. All right, so as soon as I get this card, you get what's on the top. But the bottom is for end game scoring. So this is going to be two points for each of my buildings that I build. And these symbols mean, let me just show you my board. There's uh, exactly eight different symbols in the game and it's basically a square root. So if you get the eight different symbols, it's 60, 64 points, which is a lot of points. All right, but it's kind of hard to do. All right, but you sort of have to make it a mission to get all those symbols. Uh, so what do I want to do? Do I want to go for the symbols or do I want to go for the, uh, uh, the uh, building thing here? So you know what? Let me go for the buildings. Sure, let's do that. Plus, it's cheaper right now. Uh, I might need my resources later. So I'm going to do that. You also want to look at the buildings that are out. Um, this is you need four different resources. Uh, sorry, you need four resources and they all have to be different. This is you need four resources and three of them have to be different. And these are exactly what you need. Okay, so there's my placement. Now it's going to be green's turn. Um, I think green is going to go over here to get this one. That's probably fine. Uh, then yellow's got three guys left and a ton of wood. Uh, I mean, they can turn three wood into two other resources of their choice, which is not a bad return, actually. 
Uh, so they can actually turn it to two gold, which is going to be a lot of points for them. Uh, but I think what they're going to do is, hmm. Uh, yeah, sure. Let's do that. So you're going to go here. Now it's going to be Red's turn. Uh, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to maybe try to get some of these buildings done as soon as possible. So I do need some extra resources. So I only have wood right now. So I do need to get at least another two. So maybe brick and stone to try to get this one. So let's go over here. So let's send uh, three guys. Uh, let's send three guys there. Then green's going to go and they're kind of happy that I didn't go there. So they're going to send all four of the guys to get uh, 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 wood. And then yellow has two. And they're going to restock their wood because they're going to spend three. So they're going to... Actually, do they need any food? No, they don't need food this round. So they're going to go get the two uh, wood over here. Then I'm with one guy left. And let's just go for some... You know what? I should have put them there. Sorry, let me retract a bit. I'm going to roll four dice and see what I can get there. Um, so there you go. Everyone's placed their stuff. That's phase one. Remember, phase one, place. Phase two, resolve. Uh, phase three, pay. All right, so green was first player. And I think this is the last round where I'll show you what green and yellow are doing. And then after that, I'll just skip their activations because you'll get the gist of the game. And I'll just show you what I'm going to be doing. All right, so green's going to go here. It's going to go up on the track. Next, uh, he's going to use four here. One, two, three, four. Let's roll the dice. So that's going to be four, eight, ten, thirteen divided by three is going to be four. Four times three is twelve. Yeah, it's always rounded down. So that's going to be four wood. But they're going to spend two of it right over here. All right. So they spend this to get this card, and the benefit of this is five food. Boom. Right, so they're going to keep this on their their board. And that's it, they're done. Yellow is going to do the same thing. Uh, they're going to go here, roll two dice, divided by three. So that's going to be, oh, uh, that's only going to be one. They don't have a tool. All right, so that's it. Only one wood. Kind of a shame. Uh, next, they're going to spend three of their wood. They were just expecting to get more, but they'll spend three over here uh, to get back two resources of their choice. They'll obviously take two gold because they're the hardest to come by. Um, and keep this card. And lastly, this is the love hut. They're going to generate a new worker. Boom. Just like that. Okay. That was their turn. And now finally red, uh, red has to go. So I'm going to come here. I'm going to use one wood to pay for this. Get this card. It's going to give me two food. Take the two food into my supply. All right. And, uh, Basically, I'm going to show you at end game. You can fast forward all the way to end game if you want, but these are multipliers for that at end game scoring. So it's going to be two points for each building that I have at the end of the game. All right, they're all going to stack up into your thing here. Usually you can keep a face down, but you know what? Just to show you guys what I'm doing, I'm going to put everything face up. Oops. Yeah, so that was this worker here. And finally, I'm going to roll four dice, try to get some clay. So this is divided by four. I'm hoping to get at least three. That'll be an optimal idea uh, roll. Um, oh, that's not gonna do it. So it's gonna be seven, ten, eleven. Oh, I needed uh, one more to get three. Ah, well, that's how it goes sometimes. So it's only gonna be two. Um, I wish I had a tool, but I don't. That's why you might want to get some tools for some dice mitigation. All right, so that's gonna be two uh, clay into my supply. All right, so there you go. That's the end of another round. So let's pay for our workers. Uh, so I have a five minus one, so it's still going to be four. So let me get rid of a five, take back another one. All right, green has the same exact, actually one, two, three, four. They have six minus one, so they still have to pay five. And uh, yellow has to pay six. They're down to one food left. Now in this game, you really never, never, never want to be running out of food because it's negative 10 points if you can not feed your guys, and that's pretty bad. All right, so now let's do a round reset. So yellow is going to be first player. Let's slide all the cards over. Uh, one. This one will go here, and this one will go here. Ooh, this one's... Oh, these two are really nice. All right, these are going to raise up your... Uh, 
your farm track up there. Okay, so uh, that's it for round two. Now let's go to round three. All right, so uh, who's first? Uh, yeah, yellow. Uh, so where do they want to go? Um, these cards are nice, but I think they're going to go raise. So they have six, and they're still on zero here. I think they're going to raise their farm value, so they have to pay less food every round. So that's going to be their play. Next is going to be red. Um, I'm still at five workers. I have the least amount of workers. So I can either go to Love Hut. Alternatively, I could go get one of these two cards, which is going to be good because they increase my multiplier uh, on my farm and it, without having to go on the spot. Plus, there'll be endgame points. The only problem is it is, does cost resources. Um, so before doing that, you know what? Let me go get a tool. I'm going to finally show you guys how the tools work All right, by getting one. So I'm going to do that. Now, green's going to go. And you know what? Because their first card was one of these symbols, all right, they're going to go over here. Uh, to get this symbol here for endgame scoring and this means you're going to draw a card off the top of the deck but you don't get the benefit off the top part but you can add the bonus for the endgame scoring so maybe they can get lucky and it'll be a different symbol they don't already have all right so that's gonna be green's move let's move to yellow so now yellow just needs one more resource to get this one all right so uh let's see they just need a clay so what they're gonna do is they're sort of gonna reserve it first before getting the clay by putting a worker there all right, sort of indicating that he's going to build that building. All right, now we're going to go to red. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm definitely going to go after this one here. All right, that's going to be nice for me. Uh, next is going to be green. Uh, let's see what green has. Green has just two wood and nothing else to his name. Uh, one's going to go here. And that's about it. They can't really do anything else. They would love to go here. But then they're missing a lot of wood. Um to get this and this will be another symbol to help them so you know what they're going to come here and they're going to send the rest of their guys out to go get wood afterwards and right, then it's going to be yellow yellow is four guys left yellow does need the clay like i already mentioned so you know what they're going to send all four guys go get some clay so you can score more points all right that's going to be that then red's going to go uh, now what I'm going to do is I'm running low on everything. So I have three wood and two clay. Um, I can go get some food. But I was I was second player this round. I'm going to be first player next round. And if I'm first player next round, I don't want to waste time getting food. So you know what? I'm going to go get food now. And next food, I'm not going to go get food. Sort of type of thing. All right, then it's going to be green who's last with three. And I think what they're going to do is send all four of their guys out into the woods here uh, to collect wood so they can pay for this. There you go. We're all done. Um, yeah, so let me activate everyone. I know I, was, I, was, I said I would skip their step, but because I'm second player, um, I'll show you what they did. So yellow's going to go up here. That's fine. Next, they're going to roll four dice over here. Divided by four. So that's going to be one, two, three clay them uh, next it's gonna be over here all right so the way this works again four resources of three different types so they're gonna go uh, one two three and four all right there you go so that pays for this so they're gonna keep this all right and the way it scores is that each gold is worth six each stone is worth five each so it's six five four three uh, points. So this is going to be, all right, sorry about that. It's going to be 12 plus seven. It's going to be 19 points, right? Uh, six, six, four, uh, 16, 17, 18, 19, right? Let's put this back. Um, and let's give them 19 points. So they're going to go up to 19, which is which is a good jump. So they're in the lead and yellow's done with everything. Then red's gonna go. So I'm gonna pull this guy back to get a tool. Now tools get placed on your board over here. So you get a level one, level one, level one. And next time you get a tool, it'll be level two, uh, level one, level one, then level two, level two, level one, so on and so on and so on. All right, you get the sort of gist of it. Uh, next, I'm gonna pull off this one here. So that's gonna be two wood. Oops, two wood there. Take this car. Now this one benefits gonna raise me up on the farm track over here. All right, and there's gonna be end game scoring. I'll score a point for each of my farms. So it's already gonna be two points right now. Obviously I'll get more by the end of the game. 
uh, but that's how that works. So uh, normally these would all be stacked here, but I want to show you guys the points that I'm getting. So I'm going to stack things like this for now. Uh, so that's fine. All right, now looking around, what else do I have? I got three guys on the farm space there. So I'm going to roll three dice. Now I do have a tool and I get to use it right away. So I'm going to roll. And what I get, I got a nine. All right, so the way this works is nine. Normally it would be nine divided by two is only four, but I'm going to turn it into a 10 by exhausting this, not tapping or exhausting, whatever you want to see. So that's going to be nine plus one. So that's a 10. So now I'm going to get five food instead. 10 divided by two, five. Boom. That's nice. Nice thing right there. And um, that's going to be it for, for, for red. So green's going to go, roll four. Divided by three. Uh, so it's going to be one, two, three, four, five. Wow, five wood. That's an excellent roll for green. They're happy with that. Now they're going to give up one here. And they're going to give up three here. So they netted an extra one. All right, so next they're going to pull off over here, which is going to give them this. And again, like I mentioned, there's going to be just a card for the bottom part. So there's going to be two points for every worker. It's a good card to get for free. All right, so going to add that to their stack. And then they've already paid for this one. So they're going to grab this card, which is another another symbol they needed, and they're going to go up on the track. All right. There you go. That's the end of the round. Uh, let's uh, pay for our workers. Phase three, you pay. So I'm going to, I'm still only at five, all right, but because I haven't gone to the love height yet, um, it's going to be five minus two. I'm um, only need to pay three. One, two, three. All right. So, you know, if you don't have a lot of workers and you have a lot of farms, well, eventually it'll be free to, you don't even have to f feed your guys. All right, so uh, that's that. Green's gonna be uh, paying four, because they have two as well, and six, uh, so they're gonna get one back. And uh, yellow. Okay, I just realized something that yellow had to actually go for food last round because he doesn't have enough. So he's playing really stupid because now what's going to happen is he doesn't have enough food to pay for his workers. So he's going to lose all the food that he has. He only had one left and you're going to lose 10 points. Boom. Norm normally and hopefully this never happens to you in your game, but that's just what happened. That's just what happened to yellow right now. So uh, that was kind of a shame. All right. So uh, they lost all the progress that they probably made by getting all the that... Uh, that brick anyway so let's get ready for next round so let's flip some cards over uh boom 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 uh pass the first player marker back to red and we're ready to rock and roll so i think red what we're going to do to start off is since we got so many farms uh, you know what, let's go to love hut uh just to go get that extra worker because it's going to come in handy uh, i mean you do have five of them on the side of the board there that you can get eventually as the game goes on all right so that's going to be them now green's gonna go and i don't think they have the symbol so i think their goal is uh, usually by round four or five you sort of know what you're trying to get and you sort of want to like go full full force into that strategy i think what they're going to do is try to get all the eight symbols to get the 64 points that's going to be an awesome strategy so whenever they see a symbol out here uh they're going to see if they have it so uh, they don't have that uh idol or whatever it is so they're definitely going to go into here and try to get it all right up next is going to be yellow and you know what yellow is going to join us to you know actually yellow they're thinking about tools or do they want to go on the farm um you know what they're going to go on the farm all right, i know most of us aren't getting tools this game but uh we're going to try to go up on the farm okay so that's going to be it for yellow that's going to be red's turn i only got three left um i mean do i want to do this i guess that's fine i do have a already a bonus card for buildings i mean i can go for the building strategy and try to build a lot of buildings and get this one and uh sure let's do that i'm gonna go here i'm gonna need some wood so i'm probably gonna have to send my last two guys to go get wood later all right next is gonna be green uh what do they want to do what do they want to do they got plenty of wood let's see they're gonna get another resource here uh they have seven food so they're okay with food i think they're gonna go for some clay all right, so they're going to go, uh, let's see, they need clay because they're going to get gold here. They have wood. If they can get clay, and then they might be able to build this building. So let's go clay like this. All right, let's get a bunch of clay. Then yellow is going to go. Uh, yellow needs the food. And you know what? They don't want to lose points 
again. Uh, their last player this round, I think what they're going to do is just... They got no resources. Oh, boy. Yeah, you know what? Let them just go get food. That's fine. They're going to spend a round just getting a bunch of food, uh, getting ready for the uh, following few rounds where they won't have to go to this spot for a long time. All right, that's them. Uh, I'm going to go. I'm going to go get some wood to pay for this spot. And then green is going to... Do they have one guy left? I think they're going to come right over here. I right, just... Uh, go to the spot that I just mentioned. Now, alternatively, they could also go here or here. And you know what? I think they're going to go here instead because they'll actually make more bang for their buck um, here. Um, see, four different resources. So right now, they only have wood. No, they won't even have four different resources. Basically, by having four resources, basically what you're saying is you need at least one of each and they won't have any stones. So they won't be able to do this or this. So you know what? Instead, they're just gonna do this one. That's right, fine. And there you go. All, all the guys are placed. Red is the first player, so let them go. Uh, first things first, they're gonna go here. Love hut. Get an extra worker for next round. Uh, next, let's do some wood. Let's roll two dice because there's two workers. Remember, I do have one tool, so I add plus one to this roll. That's a fantastic roll. Nine. I don't have to even add my plus one. Nine divided by three is three wood. Right, and I'm going to put one wood over, uh, sorry, two wood over here to get this card. Um, so I'll use this. And my last one is here. So, okay. So the way this works is you're going to notice these weird numbers. All right. You're going to roll the amount of dice equal to the amount of players. So it's going to be three. And each die represents what's on the card. And you're basically doing a draft in the order of starting with the player that uh, took the card. So red, then green, then yellow. All right, so I'm just hoping that there's going to be at least one five or one six, so at least I can get a huge benefit. Right, so let's roll, and this is probably the best roll you can possibly imagine because I'm going to grab the six, which is going to be a free uh, movement up on the farm track, which is gigantic. And then my opponents, all they're going to get is they're going to one's going to draft the one, the other one's going to draft the one, and the one just represents wood. All right, so they got the worst benefit from the card. That's awesome. All right, but I'm gonna keep this card and it's gonna go, I'm gonna add it here because it's gonna to add to my multiplication here for building. So every building that I built, I'm gonna make three points. All right, uh, so that's that. And I'm pretty much done with the uh, red. So like I mentioned previously, I'm gonna do everyone's turn. I'll be back just for the end of the round. All right, I did everyone's turn. I did their feeding. I didn't do it for me though. So I have six uh, workers minus three. Well, you get three food and then you pay, but I just minus it. So. Uh, six minus three, so I do have to pay three food. So let me give away this five, give back a two. Untap my uh, my tools, and then we refill the board. And we're pretty much ready to go right after this. Uh, I do have to flip this over. And I do sort of want to build a building <laughs> sooner rather than later, because remember, I do have these multipliers for building. So the more buildings I build, the more points I'll get at the end of the game. All right, so uh, pass first player marker to green, and we're ready to go. So what does green want to do? Uh, let's see. Right now they have... I uh, think what they're going to do is they're going to go for the love hut, get more workers. Uh, they only have three food left, so probably after doing this, they're going to send all their workers there, and I should not forget. <laughs> I don't want them to lose 10 points. All right, like yellow did. All right, yellow's going to go up next. And you know what? Uh, they have four food. They're going to have to pay four right now. But if they raise up their farm, they'll be fine. They could go for a tool instead. Um, you know what? They're going to go for a tool. They're going to go over here. All right. So now we're going to go up to red. And what do I want to do? So what I'm eyeing, let's see. What am I eyeing? These are all great point uh, generation things. But here you need all four resources. All four resources are four different resources in the game. You need to have all of them, but four in total. So this is one of each, and this is one of each plus one of anything else. Uh, this one is two wood and a gold. I mean, to my name right now, I just have two brick and two wood. Uh, I mean, I'm gonna need a stone and a gold. So I can maybe come here for the gold and then send a bunch of guys there to go get the stone. Sure, let's try that. Uh, plus this is gonna give me another multiplier for workers, which might be good. All right, so let me go there. Uh, then we're going to go back to green and like I said green just needs a lot of food so they're going to go there then yellow Let's see what is yellow and the yellow has a couple of wood and 
See, they have enough food, so they don't have to send their food yet. Next turn, they're going to need to. Uh, let me look at their bonus cards. I mean, they're, they're not doing great on the cards either. Um, they can go here because they're going to get tools. Maybe to get their multipliers up on tools. Um, sure, let's do that. So yellow is going to go there. Uh, back to red. Uh, what did I want to do? I want to send a bunch of guys to the stone, right? So let's do it. Let's try to generate as much stone as possible. So let's go. Actually, wait. I do want to send the one guy to build the building. Or do I do that next turn? You know what? Let me do that next turn. So I'll send all my guys here to get a bunch of stone. Right, with five dice divided by five, hopefully I can get a lot of stone. All right, that's it for me. Yellow is going to go. Um, I think yellow is going to send uh, two guys for wood and two guys for food. And we're going to call it a day. Uh, so green's going to go. He's going to go here, get another baby. All right, they're going to roll over here, which is just four dice divided by two. Ooh, that's a great roll. So it's 10, uh, 18. That's going to be nine food for them. That'll keep them good for a little while. And that's all they're going to do. It's pretty simple. Uh, now yellow is going to do the same thing. Uh, here, this is going to give them a tool that they can use this round. You don't have to wait. This goes on their board. Uh, two for wood. That's going to be exactly two wood. Lucky for them. Uh, actually, you know what? They're going to spend those two wood for this card. Uh, so these two guys, they're going to get this. Now, this is a one-time benefit that you can sort of put this into your uh, display uh, to gain plus four to any roll that you're going to do. All right, but you can only use it once. I'm going to play it there so I don't forget. Uh, so that was that, that was that. And now I'm going to roll for their food. They can add plus one to this roll, remember, because they're tool. And they're going to get, let's see, the seven plus one, eight. So they're going to get four food. One, two, three, four. All right, so that's it for yellow. We're going to go to red. Now, what did I want to do? I want to get a ton of stone. All right. Uh, well, first, let me do this card here. So I do need to give in a resource. So let's give in a wood. Um, this is going to give me a gold. Uh, right over here. Uh, this card is going to go, let's just put it over here. Add it to my multipliers. All right, so that was that. Now I'm going to roll for my stone. So I'm going to roll five dice. Hope for the best. All right, so roll five dice. Divide by five. Let's see what's going to happen. So it's a pretty good roll. So it's 12, 17. Uh, well, it's going to be uh, one, two, three, four, five stone. Because um, if I reduce this to five and add a plus one here, you can do some quick math. And then you reduce this to five. To add plus one here plus my tool that adds plus one so what you got to do is you just tap your tool boop you're gonna change this to a five and you're gonna one two three four five five stone that's a lot of stone uh, one three four five that's gonna sit over here and there you go we're done for the round so we got to pay for feed our people so green is up first one two three four five six seven so now they have seven minus two they still have to pay five there's a five. Uh, yellow's got six minus two, uh, which is going to be four. One, two, three, one, two, three, four. And I have six as well, uh, minus three, so I only have to pay three. So I do need to go get some food next turn or raise my production by uh, my farm by one. All right, and there's the go. We fed. We're going to untap our tools. We're going to slide everything over. Refill. Ooh, I don't need stone, but there's a way to get a nice stone. Uh, I do have to check if green needs the symbol. Remember, they're going after the uh, the symbols. So uh, they got the, the idol, the, uh, the compass, the tablet. and uh, So they already have this one, and they already have this one. They're going to look for the cart. All right, that's good. All right, so we pass first player marker to yellow, and it's their turn. All right, so what yellow is going to do is, you know what? Um, the, I was going to think about getting tools for them. Maybe they're going to go down the tool, uh, getting a lot of tools track because they're getting multipliers for tools. Uh, but instead of going here, they can just go here and get a tool. Plus, it's a symbol for endgame scoring. Um, I mean, it's not the end of the world. I think that's what they're going to do. All right, so you're just... 
I mean, what are the chances somebody else goes here before it's their turn? Because if they go here, uh, then they're pretty sure red's going to go in one of these two spots maybe or get this one. Uh, then green's going to go. Does green go for this? I don't think green is interested in tools. So did they take a chance? Uh, I think they do. They take a chance. They know they're a little bit behind because they lost the 10 points. So they're going to go there first. Right, then red's going to go. And... Uh, you know, I'm going to have a turn where I'm going to just uh, make a baby, get that building that I want to build, and then go get some food. So I'm going to do this. Then green's going to go. And what does green want to do? So green is missing, let's see, what do they want to build? They're missing uh, hmm, gold for this. They're missing stone. Well, they're going to get stone next turn for sure because they're going to want to get this. So did they go for some gold? Yeah, let's go for some gold. So they're going to send four guys over here. Hopefully they get at least uh, two gold. You know what? I'm going to send another guy. There's five guys in there. See what happens. All right, yellow's going to go. Now they're happy, so they can go over here. Then red's going to go. Um, I think I'm going to send one guy over here or over here. Let's go over there. All right, then green's going to go. I think they're going to have two guys left, so they're going to go get some wood. Yeah, they're okay. Then yellow's gonna go. Yellow does need a bit of food as well, so they're gonna actually uh, they're gonna go get some wood. Then red's gonna go get some food, and then yellow, the last piece, is gonna go get some food. And I think we're good. All right, so yellow's up first. They're gonna grab a tool here. All right, then they're gonna roll. Actually, no, they're going to do this first. So they're going to give up two wood to get this card, which gives them another tool. Uh, plus the idol, which is not bad. All right, then they're going to roll here because now they got three tools. So they can add plus three to their roll, which is equal to another wood. All right, so let's roll three. Uh, five, uh, nine, 11, plus three. Uh, it's 14, so that's going to be uh, four, four wood. Three, four. Um, and oh, they got a roll for this. So they would have used only two. Um, actually, they would have only used one tool because they only needed to get uh, 12. The extra two didn't matter. So the, when they roll one die for this, they can add plus two. So it's five plus two is seven. So that's going to be only three food. All right, so there goes yellow's turn. Now red's going to go. So make a baby here. Um, we're gonna roll for some uh, food here. So let's roll three dice. Okay, so it's gonna be two food, two food, two food. So it's gonna be six food in total. Um, uh, yeah, the plus one would have done absolutely nothing. And then finally, let's, uh, that would have been these three. And then finally, let's build this building. All right, so the way these work, is uh, again four different goods and five goods in total so i'm gonna go one two three four different goods and an extra one all right so there you go so that's what i'm paying so now let's calculate the points all right so the way you score this is each gold is worth six points and stone is worth five uh, brick four and wood three all right so it's gonna be six plus uh 10 so it's 16 plus Four is 20 plus 3 is 23 points. All right, let's put this back and get on the board. All right, there you go. And this is going to go on my display here. All right, and we're pretty much done for the turn. All right, let's do a quick turn here for green. So it's going to be five dice to try to get some gold. Uh, so it's 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So that's going to be three gold. Let's give that to them. And uh, they got a couple of wood here. Uh, wow, that's horrendous. That's only going to be one wood. All right, well, that's how it rolls sometimes. All right, so uh, slide everything. We've got to pay for our people, but I'm just doing this right now. All right, so now I have seven guys. All right, you can also tell minus 10 uh, guys that you have left over on the side. So seven minus uh, three, I still have to pay four. So let's get rid of the five. Back a one. Uh, let's see. Let's see the other players is uh, seven again for green minus uh, two is five. Ooh, they're almost out of food. 
They're going to need to get some food next turn. And uh, it's going to be uh, five as well. Actually, it's only going to be four. Because they have six minus two. It's going to be four for yellow. And boom, there you go. The end of another round. We're going to give this to the red player. And let's get... Oh, I'm forgetting one card. And uh, let's get started. Okay, so red's up first. I'm not sure what I want to do, actually. Um... <laughs> Look at my bonuses here. Uh, at this point in the game, I should have a strategy, but you know, I'm not getting a lot of synergy. I'm just getting a lot of buildings, so every building's times three. So I do want to build a lot of buildings, but that costs a lot of resources. Uh, the other thing that I could get is maybe raising my farms a lot, because then I can get this one, and then it's times three my position. Uh, so if I can get both of those up really high, that'll be useful. Uh, so let's try to do that. I'm gonna forego getting tools, I think, and just try to raise up my farm as much as I can. So. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come here. All right, then green is gonna go. And green needs a lot of food. So uh, I remember they wanted this, right? No, they already had this symbol. They wanted this one. Uh, yeah, they wanted that one. They wanted that one, they wanted that one. Uh, I mean, this is really three wood for two stone. It's okay conversion, not the best. Uh, but then they'll be able to do this afterwards and try to score a bunch of points. So they can go here, here, and then get food. Uh, but then they're not getting one of these uh, useful spots here. Uh, they can also delay that one extra round because the other two players are not even close to getting that. So, um, you know what? Let's. Uh, they're gonna go get a baby and then dump everything into into uh, into food production to to get some food. All right. So they're gonna do that. Then yellow's gonna go. Now yellow doesn't have this symbol, so they're gonna come here. All right. Then red's gonna go, and I'm definitely gonna come here. Then green's gonna go, and let's see. They have. Five guys. Did they put all five guys on the food or did they split it up? Um, they're missing just one stone to be able to get this, but they have absolutely no food. You know what? Let them. Uh, let them. Let them. Yeah, you know what? Let's spend the whole turn getting food. Then green won't have to go get food for a while unless they roll extremely poorly. Now let's do, do that. And yellow is going to go. And yellow has a ton of wood, a ton of brick. And nothing else. So they're going to uh, send. Oh, they need food too. Oh boy, they only have. Okay, you know what? There's gonna be a quick round for everyone. I think I'm just gonna do that for them. Uh, then we're gonna do red, who is going to. I barely have enough food as well. Uh, but I do need some wood for this. I have absolutely no wood to pay for that. So, uh, and this is gonna give me three food. So, you know what? Let's just go crazy and get a ton of wood. That's what I'm gonna do. There you go. All right, there you go. Simple, simple round. All right, so we're gonna activate red first. Gonna go up the, the track here. All right, we're gonna roll here, so it's five dice. Let's shoot for five. Let's see what we get. High numbers, high numbers, high numbers. Oh, a couple of ones, not good. Come on, sit down. Uh, so it's uh, 11, 13, 14, 15. Uh, I do have a tool uh, to make it 16, but it doesn't really matter. It's just gonna be five wood. That's not a great return for five dice on wood. One, two, three, four, five. There you go. I'm going to need to pay for two of them to get this card, which is going to get me three food back. So two, three. And I'll put, a, put this over here. I got some stuff for farms here, which is pretty good. And I got some stuff for buildings. All right, so uh, that's gonna be it for uh, red. So I'm just gonna do the other player's turns and I'll be back for the end of the round. Okay, so for green, uh, thinking about a little strategy here. I mean, they really wanna get the farm up because they're spending five food a turn on every round. That's a lot. That's really way, 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 way too much. Uh, uh, but they really want this as well to get one of each and then they can go get this. So they can get this and this, this turn if they forego getting this. Because if they go here, they're pretty sure the yellow player is gonna go grab this card because they need this icon as well and they need the stone as well. Um, so you know what? I think this is more important for them if they can get all eight different icons at 64 points. Um, so that's gonna be good. All right, so they're gonna go here as their first move. Then yellow is gonna go. And uh, yellow is, uh, let's see, they're looking for tools. They might wanna come here, but they're pretty sure this one's gonna be available. So you know what? They're gonna go get more tools. They're gonna come here. Uh, then red's gonna go and you know what? while it's open might as well go raise my farm and Then green hates me because they were really wanted that spot, but you know what 
since they got that now they're gonna go get this spot over here to go get the points and build the building uh yellow is gonna go uh let's see they have plenty of food they don't need to get food uh they're running low on wood though um let's see they want to get this we already mentioned um what they're gonna do is let's see they need gold for either of these so what they're gonna do is they're gonna send two guys over here and they're pretty sure to get at least one gold for two guys and they'll send one guy here and then maybe with the other two guys get some food they're gonna do that then we're gonna circle back to red and red you know what red's gonna come over here then green oh man green 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 uh green's already building this building uh, he won't have enough for this actually he will have enough see this is two you know what they're gonna come over here and build another building that's awesome for them then yellow is gonna go and what do they want to do uh oh they wanted that building no <laughs> that's what they were planning to do so green just shut them out uh that's a shame so i guess they're going to send guys to get food so next turn they're going to be first player and they don't have to worry about getting food next turn and then we're going to circle back to red who is going to build this building and then green's going to go and they're going to push all in onto the uh the food there's again they're they're bleeding out food and then red's left uh, i think red's going to uh go get a bunch of wood all right let's do something like that that's fine all right so because red's last, I'm going to do everyone else's turn. I'll come back uh, resolving red and this card. Okay, so that's interesting. Uh, green built two buildings, so they shot up with 30 points uh, way ahead of everyone else. So that's pretty good. Um, yellow's a bit lagging behind. All right, so let's resolve red. Red, again, the farm here, which is good for me. Uh, then I'm going to resolve the wood, so plus four dice. One, two, three, four. I do have one tool, so I can add plus one to this, whatever it is. Uh, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, plus 1 won't make a difference. That's going to be 4 wood. Uh, 4 times 3 is 12. All right. Then I'm going to give up uh, 2 of that wood uh, to do this card. So you remember what that does from last round. Roll 3 dice. And ooh, that's pretty good. So I can raise my farm, get a tool, or 3 is get a stone. So obviously I'm going to raise my farm again. Ooh. Uh, so that was the six, and green's gonna take the five, which is a tool. Although, do they really want a tool? Yeah, they're gonna get a tool. Might as well. Uh, it's worth more than just one stone, which is what yellow's gonna get. All right, so that's good. Um, then I'm gonna pay for this. All right, so this is gonna be a stone, a clay, and a gold. And it's going to be 15 points. So 15 plus 23, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So that's uh, 38. Boom. 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 And there you go. That's the end of the round. Now, feeding your people. <laughs> Look how far I am up the track. I have uh, 7 people minus 6. That means I only got to pay 1 food a turn. I probably never have to, to go hunt for the rest of the game. Unless I want to get all, all my 10 guys, but we'll see what happens. Uh, then green is the same. Uh, actually, has 8 minus a 6. Oh, boy. Six. He's got to pay 6 every round. Oof. He's really des in desperate need to raise up his farms. Uh, so that's green. And then yellow has uh, 6 minus 2, which is 4. All right. But that's fine. I'm going to pass first player marker over to yellow. That's this little marker. Uh, we're going to slide everything over. Um, did I? Yeah, I did forget to take my card, right? Yes. Yes? No? Yep. Yeah. I think that's mine. Sorry about that. Uh, flip all this over. All right, so the game's going to end when this stack runs out. Well, any of these stacks run out. Or if we run out of cards. Most likely it's going to be the buildings, but we'll see what happens. Uh, the flute and another carriage uh so yellow's turn all right i think yellow's gonna do the same thing like last time i think they're gonna take a chance they're gonna go get a tool and they're gonna go get this card here which gives them points for tools because i think both me and green are not interested in this end game scoring at all they're sure that this card's gonna stay there so um let's do that they're gonna go there then it's gonna be red's turn 
Uh, now I only have wood and stone left. That doesn't really help with any of these. I need to get some gold or some clay. Um, I could go here. That'll give me points for my guys. And then I can maybe get some more guys later on. Um, you know what? I think I'm going to go here so that then I can go. Actually, no, I already have stone. Uh, unless I go here and then I go get something else. Because I'm not interested in these cards either. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to go have a baby. It's probably my best bet. Because I got so many farms, I can afford paying some uh, some food every round. So that's fine. So that's going to be me. Uh, Green is really upset because that's what he wanted to do. Uh, so what else can he do? Uh, he's going to run out of food so fast. Uh, okay, so he's got almost no resources, including wood, to pay for cards. So I think what he's going to do, he's going to... Dump a bunch of guys into the forest. One, two, three, four, five. You know what? Six. We're going to load up to try to get cards. Uh, they got no wood, so that's fine. So that's what they're going to do there. Yellow, we already know, is going to come here. Then red. Let's see, what resource do I need? I need clay and I need gold. So I'm going to go with uh, three on clay or three on gold. What do you think? Uh, or I can go all, all one, two, three, four, five. I can go all five. Uh, on clay now you know what let's go uh, four on clay go four on clay there you go then green's gonna go he's gonna go two food here then yellow is gonna go and I think yellow wanted to build one of these buildings yeah so he's gonna look at the one that's uh, the most points and he's gonna go for that one and then I'm gonna go and uh, Let's see, I wanted this one. There you go, that's fine. Because I'll have no gold. Yeah. And then yellow is the only guy with guy, only one with guys left. Um, I think, I think, I think they're going to try to get some stone. Uh, yes, yeah, so they're going to put three guys on stone. All right, so there you go, we're done. All right, so let's just activate. So yellow is going to raise a tool. So he already has six tools. That's insane. Uh, you're going to build this. So clay stone. This is going to be 15 points. 15 plus 9 is uh, 24. Yeah. 24, let's put that on the board. All right. Um, oh, and there you go. So 3. They add plus 6 to whatever this roll is, which is insane. So divide by 5. Uh, six, seven, eight, plus five, 13. That's still only going to be two stone. Not the best roll, but eh, it's better than nothing. Okay, there you go. Then red's going to go. Oh, sorry. They had this one as well. So they're going to do this to give up a wood. Uh, to roll three dice. Uh, so they're going to get another tool. That's insane. They're going to get to a level three tool. All about the tools. All right, um, then I'm going to draft the three, which is a stone, and then green's going to draft the one, which is a wood. Oh, poor green. All right, let's not cry for him too much. So let's give that to uh, to the yellow player. All right, then red's going to go. So I'm going to go here, make another baby. So I'm at eight, eight, eight children now. Um, I'm going to go over here, so it's going to be four dice, one, two, three, four. I can add plus one divided by four, uh, so it's 11, 12, 13. I can make it 14, doesn't really matter, so that's going to be three clay on my board. And then I'm going to build this. So this is going to be one wood, one clay, one stone. It's going to be 12 points, uh, 12, 12, 12. One, two plus 10, I'm at 50. Beautiful. All right, what's green doing? Not much. <laughs> He's one, two, three, four, five, six. Six dice divided by three. Nine, 10, uh, 14, 17, 23 divided by three is seven. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's good. Oh my goodness. A lot of wood. Uh, and then they're going to roll two for the food. <laughs> wow, two food. Well, that's pretty bad. And they didn't have, they have one tool, but it wouldn't have made a difference. 
Okay, so that's the end of the round. Let's feed our people. So I have eight minus six, which is two. So I'm pretty much out of food. I'm gonna need to get some food next time. Um, unless I raise my production by one, then I only have to pay one food, but we'll see what happens. Um, uh, green has to still pay eight minus two is six. Oh my God. He's bleeding food. So it's six. Um, and yellow is six minus two is four. And there you go. Slide all this over. Flip this over. Flip another card. Ooh, that one's for green. Actually, green wants this one as well. Um, so let's look at green's cards. So they got the carriage already. So they need both of these ones, this one and this one. So they're going to try to get those for sure. All right. Uh, so that's the end of the round. Uh, let's pass the first player marker to red. And we're almost over. I mean, the game's going to last uh, probably four more rounds. Um, deck is still kind of large, but probably we're going to end up building these buildings uh, in the next consecutive turns. All right. So I'm going to try to speed run these last few rounds as fast as possible. So red's up first. Um, you know what? Let's go for the, let's go for the farm. Then a uh, green's going to go. Um, I think he's going to go for, oh man, none of these are interesting. Actually, you know what? Red was going to go for another worker instead. I think green's going to go here. So I'm taking a little step back. Uh, I do want to generate my ninth worker. I'm going to go get some food this round anyway. So it's going to be fine. That's fine. Uh, then yellow. Uh, oh man, nothing here helps yellow out too much. Uh, let's see, they have a couple. Of, they can actually go get this one. So they're going to come here right away. Reserve that. Yellow's going to go. Uh, oh, sorry, red's going to go. I think I'm going to go uh, over here. Yeah, I'm going to go there. Uh, then green's going to go. And I don't think he wants to get shut out. So he's going to come here. We're all going to build buildings this round. And then yellow's up. Actually, no, wait. Green doesn't want to lose this. But you know what? He's Does he take a chance? Now, you know what? These symbols are more important for him. He's he's pretty sure nobody's going to go on that one. So he's going to go over here. And right, then yellow's going to go. Um, yellow needs resources. Resources. All kinds of resources. So they're going to send two guys to get some gold. Then red's going to go. I think I'm just going to come here. Then green's going to go. And you know what? They're going to go a little crazy. They're going to spend four wood to go right over here. And I think they're okay with that because uh, that's going to be like a 12-point card for them or something. Um, then yellow's going to go. Um, they're running out of resources. So they're going to go. They're getting some gold. Let's go get some wood back. Let's do that. Then red's going to go. I think I'm going to send... Uh, what do I want to do? What do I want to do? I think I'm going to send them. I think I'm going to send everyone to get food. So I'm going to have to go for food for the rest of the game again. So let's do that. And then green is going to... Um, I think what they're going to do is they're going to send everyone in. There you go. Whoops, small change. I did realize that I needed the gold to try to get this because I have no gold in my, uh, in my possession. So a little bit of a take back here. So I'm going to roll for the gold first. Uh, I do need at least a five to get my one gold with my tool. So let's roll. Oh, I got a six, which is exactly one gold. All right. Then I'm going to spend one gold and one stone and one wood. So I'm going to spend this one, two, and three to build this. So that's going to be 14 points. So 10, one, two, three, four. All right. Add that to my board. All right. Uh, I already took my guy i believe for this yeah that's fine and then i'm gonna roll for, sorry this is already done and then i'm gonna roll two for food uh that's six that's gonna be three food one two okay i'm gonna do everyone else's turn i'll be oh, actually wait i forgot this okay sorry about that oh too many guys i'm gonna spend a wood for this so what this means is you're gonna roll two dice and you're gonna do the same conversion so divided by five so that's gonna be one stone Right. Not bad, but it does get to add to my multiplier, and that's going to be because I have nine guys, that's going to be a lot of points. All right, and there you go. All right, I'll be back. I already did this, I'll be back for the next turn. All right, so uh, yeah, I just finished the turn, I paid for everyone's food, so let's not waste any more time. So, green's up first. Uh, I think what green's going to do is they're going to go get another baby, 
even though they're not up on the track too much, they're going to pay a ton of food every round, but it's almost over anyway, so it's not so bad. All right, then yellow is going to go, going to go for tools again. That's what their plan is all along. And then, then what do I want to do? I think I'm going to keep building buildings. Remember, I do have the multiplier here for the amount of buildings that I built. So uh, let's get to my fifth building here, which isn't bad. That one's easy to build. And then there's going to be only one left to end game next turn. Okay, so back to green. And green, remember, he's chasing those symbols, but he has all those symbols already. He sort of he sort of wants all these cards to cycle as fast as possible so he can try to get to the one that he doesn't have. But he's not interested in any of these. Um, I think he has to wait for yellow or red to flip them, or he's going to keep a couple of guys back to maybe flip them as well. Um, let's see, he doesn't have enough for either of these just yet. I mean, he can go reserve and then go get the resources. Yeah, let's do that for this round. So he's going to go here. That's fine. Uh, then yellow is going to go next. And you know what? Yellow doesn't have some of those symbols. Let me look at their symbols. Yeah, they don't have either of these. So if they can get both of those, they're pretty good. So they're going to go for one here. All right. Then red's going to go. And uh, you know what? Let's go for this one because I'm super high on that track. That gives me points for that. Let's go get that. Then green is going to... I uh, guess they're going to go for wood. Let's, send, let's, send. let's keep one guy for food. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, then yellow is going to go next. They already know what they want to do. They're going to go here. Then red's going to go. Um, I just want to go collect some resources at this. Although I'm not going to have food. Oh, I can't forget. I got one food left. Um, you know what? There's only one round after this. Do I send everyone for food? No, that would be a stupid idea. So let's send three guys to get the clay that I'm about to lose. Well, this costs three wood and I only have two wood in my possession. You know what? Let's go over here. Well, I say wood because I'd rather spend wood than clay here, obviously. So let me spend guys there. Green's got one guy, he's gonna go here. Yellow's got three guys left. They're going to go into the clay pit. Uh, let's see, they got to spend for this. They got gold for this. Uh, Actually, they're going to put a guy here. That's fine. Then red's going to go. I'm going to go clay for three, for four guys. And then yellow's going to send for two to get the clay for this. All right, pretty simple. Uh, because red is last, let me activate everyone else. We'll try to get this done as fast as possible. Um, yeah, I'll be back. All right, the other two players did their turns. Let's get to this. Uh, roll for clay. Uh, Oh, that's nice. 12, 17, 18, 19 divided by 4. I'm going to use my one tool to make it a 20. So that's going to be 5 clay. All right, then I'm going to this those guys and roll 3 divided by 3. Uh, that's a 9, 10, 11. That's only going to be 3. All right, so that takes you to that. And then I'm going to spend those 3 that I just got. Uh, to get this one over here, which is going to give me a stone. All right, but this adds to my multiplier here. Uh, next up is going to be paying for this. So two clay and a wood. I'm probably going to have to pay some cards with clay. I got so much clay. Um, there you go. And that's going to give me 11 points. So one plus 10, 75. All right, let's add that to my stack of buildings. And... Uh, uh, I think that's it, right? Yeah, so let's reset, let's pay for food, and I'll be back. All right, uh, during payment of food, I realized one stupid thing is for red, well, I have nine guys minus seven, I have to pay two food. Unfortunately, I have only one food. All right, so what you can do in this game is you can substitute any resource as food. So, uh, you know what? Let me get rid of a clay, <laughs> whatever. Uh, I got a lot of clay, uh, so that's what I had to do. And then you'd flip everything around, refresh, pass the first player to yellow, and then you're ready to go. Right, so yellow's going to go first. I think they're going to do the same strategies multiple rounds they've done this round. You know, they really want this card, but nobody's going to go for that but them. So they're going to come over here to get their tool, and then they're going to go over here to increase their multiplier for tools. And they're on the fourth level of tools right now, which is insane. Okay, uh, then red's going to go. And, uh, oh, there are two tiles left here. Um, all right, so two rounds left, and that's actually good for green because we flop the cards and he still doesn't see the symbol that he's waiting for. It's going to be in the last few cards over here. Well, two copies of that are in there. So 
all right, so yellow went there. What is what does uh, red want to do? Uh, I can either raise my farm or get my last worker. Uh, none of these cards really are useful for me unless I get this one, which is two. Actually, this card would be really good for me. Uh, but I think I'm going to wait for it to cost a bit less. Four resources for that is kind of a bit. Uh, so you know what? Let me go raise my stuff here. All right, then green's going to go. Um, let's see. What thing does he want to build? I think he's going to go for this one. All right, because he's got no gold. Uh, then yellow is going to go. I think we're all going to end up picking a building this round. I think they're going to go. Well, they got no stones. So they're going to have to figure out a way to get stone. Actually, no, wait. They wanted this, remember? Yeah, they're going to definitely go here. They're, they really need this card. Then red's going to go. And I got, I can build any of these. So let me, do I want to waste my gold? Or do I want to waste my stone? Let's go for the stone. All right, so I get at least one of every resource after. So I'm going to go there. Although I do want the game to end. So I can go here instead well you know what if i don't go here green's probably gonna, ah doesn't really matter green's gonna go on the one that i don't go on anyway so let's go over here so then green's gonna go over here uh, which is a bit of a shame for yellow uh, but i think what yellow is gonna do is they're gonna go get more cards uh, they're gonna go for that one uh, back to red um let's just go for you know what i could probably if i dump all these guys on wood i could probably get that card now um yeah let's do that so i'm gonna go here then green's gonna go um and they need gold so let's they're gonna send you know what five guys to gold that's fine uh they're okay with that then yellow's gonna go yellow needs food so they don't want to go broke on food they're gonna go there i need food as well so i'm gonna do let's see i'm gonna send four guys here no three guys here and three guys to food and then green is last and uh they're going to get food all right pretty simple turn all right so uh let me just activate everyone's turn and i'll be back all right so i'm making it quick i did everyone's turn already whoops i've got to take this back uh, so if you want to see where i'm at right here i got uh, six buildings built uh got a bunch of different multipliers all over the place uh so let's slide everything over so this is gonna be the last round of the game for sure so if either of these stacks are empty it's over uh green is looking for a specific symbol i think it was the pot so that's gonna be good for them Ooh, i'm gonna want that for sure because i got six buildings that's a lot of points for me um and first player is gonna be red all right so what do i want to do all right so red i think what i'm gonna do to start is i'm gonna this is probably the best building to get at the end of the game uh, because you can just dump all your resources in there and you end up calculating points. So one to seven resources and equal those points. So I'm just going to dump all my points in there and score a ton of points. Uh, green, easy decision. They're going to go get their last symbol that they're missing. That's going to be a 64 point set now that they're going to get with that. All right, so yellow is up next. Um, see, yellow wants this to <laughs> increase their tools again and get that. Uh, but they do have a ton of resources that they do want to get rid of. Uh, some, this is five of one resource, uh, four of one resource. Um, I think they are going to go here, uh, back to red, who is going to go over. I really want this. This is going to be really good for me. Uh, but I'm missing some wood for that. Or, you know, what? yeah, missing resource. You know what? Let's go here with the rest of my guys. Um, probably going to get a ton of wood and just pay everything in wood. Uh, get that uh, then green's gonna go and at this point green is just gonna build this building then yellow is gonna come over here yeah actually they're gonna come over here All right, then red's gonna go and I'm gonna go one two three four five six seven one two three four five six seven just dump everything in there that's fine then green is gonna go and uh I guess they're gonna raise their farm. There's no nothing else they can do. Yellow's gonna go and yellow, ooh, yellow needed, because yellow wants to pay for this and they wanna pay for this and they need to pay for this. You know what? Because they have a ton of um, tools, they don't. They can put one guy in clay and it'll give them a ton of clay. So it doesn't really matter. So they're gonna go here to get this tool and this multiplier. Then green's got a ton of guys left. Uh, where do they wanna go? So this is all of one resource. 
Uh, you know what they're gonna try to do? One, two, three, four, five, six. With six guys, you know what they're gonna go out clay. Try to get a ton of points from clay. And they don't have a choice. Uh, yellow is gonna send one guy into clay, and uh, they have only one guy left, so one guy into to tools, and then they don't need food. They're gonna go one guy into. Actually, you know what? Instead of doing that, let him do that. That's probably better. Um, so there you go. That's gonna trigger the end of the game because we're gonna end up uh, buying this stuff. But red's gonna go first. All right. So let me show you red's final turn. All right. So here I have one, two, three, four, five, seven dice. All seven. Divide by three. How much wood am I gonna get? Let's see what happens. Um, 10, 15, 19, 22, 26. Um, oh, 27. So that's going to be nine wood. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right, I'm going to leave four of them right over here. So I'm going to take all this back. All right, uh, I'm going to pay four over here. So this is going to be three points. One, two, three. Three, that's all that means right, but I'm gonna add it oops to my building stack here so all of my multipliers for buildings which is really good uh, next uh, well I only got one thing left to activate uh, which is this thing so this is one to seven resources I'm just gonna give up as much as I can so it's gonna be one two three four five six seven oops and let's just build that so that's going to be 6 plus 5, 11, uh, plus 3 is 14, plus 4 times 4 is 16. So that's going to be a 30 point building. So 30 plus 92, uh, let's go 10, 20, 30. Huge. Absolutely huge. All right. Let's do that. All right, and there you go. That was my turn. Then done. So green's gonna go raise their farm. Not that it matters. Um, get this. Spend two wood for this. Roll three dice. Uh, they're gonna take a five, which is a. I mean, yeah, sure. Let them. Actually, did they even need it? Yeah. Well, they don't need the clay either. Actually, they do need the clay. Uh, no, they're gonna take the tool. That's fine. Maybe they'll, they'll need it when they have to roll for the clay. Right, they're gonna do that, and both of us are gonna get a clay each. It doesn't really matter for red at this point, uh, but he's gonna keep the card, which is good for him. And then one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, so divided by four. One, two, three, four, five, uh, so 10, 18, 22, 23, he has two tools. You can make it 24, which he will. So that's going to be six clay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right, that's all of these guys. All right, buddy's going to spend four of them here. One, two, three, four. So that's going to be four times four. He's going to be 16 points for this one. So one, two, three, four, five, six plus 10. One was seven. Uh, and that's all he's got left on the board. Done. So now we're going to do yellow, 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 yellow. So raise another one. He's got all level four tools. That's gigantic. All right, next he's going to roll for the... Uh, he's going to roll for the stone. So he's got plus 12 on whatever he rolls. All right, which is going to be 11 plus 12, 23 divided by 5. It's going to be four stone. All right, what he's going to do is going to give up uh, five. Right, these are these two. He's gonna give five to get this. So it's gonna be five times five. It's gonna be twenty-five points. One, two, three, four, five plus twenty is eighty-two. A little bit behind everyone else. Uh, next, he's gonna spend four resources in total here. Um, this I already did. So four resources in total. One, two, three, four. All right, to get these two cards, this gives him, uh, this doesn't really matter. And this one gives him three food, which shouldn't matter that much. All right, he's gonna keep these into his supply. All right, and there you go, we've activated, we're done the game. Game end triggered. Uh, there was only 
uh, five cards left in the deck anyway, so it'll probably end it in very soon either way. Uh, but there you go. So what I'm going to do is let me show you how to calculate the points uh, each player at a time. Okay, so let's start off by, by the way, I have to feed my people. I fed everyone this time. So let's start off by looking at the green players uh, board because they have the uh, big multiplier thing. So you just went big. you're basically going to pick up all your cards and calculate the end game scoring, which is looking at the bottom part. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight different symbols. You're going to see over here for the symbol cards, uh, eight is the most because there's eight different symbols. You get 64 points. All right, so 64 plus seven is 71. So they're going to go all the way to 71. Oops, I'm in the way. Uh, I believe you had one other card. Yeah, you had one other card. So it's two points per the amount of guys that you had. They had nine uh, guys on the board. So that's going to be nine more points. So 80. So that 180 points. And that's their score, I believe. Oh, I did forget to add the points for resources. So you do get one point per. One, two, three, four, five. So it's five more. One, two, three, four, five. So they're at... 185 points uh, total. Let's put this away. All right, let's look at yellow. Let's go grab their board. I don't think they're going to win, but we'll see how far they can get. All right, so looking at their board, they have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wow, they got pretty far on that, actually. Do they have any duplicates? Uh, they do not. That's seven times seven. That's gonna be 49 points. Oh uh, wait, seven times, yeah, seven, 49 points. So let's give them 50 and remove one. Uh, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. So that's 49 points there. Yeah, that's pretty good for them. Um, next, uh, they're gonna get, this is crazy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven points per tool, and they have seven times 12. I'm gonna need a calculator. Uh, that's gonna be 52. No, seven times uh, 12 is like over 80 points, right? All right, well, yellow just made me eat my words, and I think they're gonna win. That's an extra 84 points. Uh, that's crazy. So that's gonna be 115. So if you go 115 past there, I believe you get to 100 and uh, yeah, 115. So they're at 215 points. Yeah, 84 plus uh, 84 plus 31 is uh, say 35 plus uh, 30 and 80. Yeah, so yeah, so that's right. So uh, plus three, one, two, three. So there you go. Um, wow, I think yellow's gonna win. <laughs> we'll see how far uh, red gets. Uh, getting my board. Uh, let's get all my multipliers here. We're gonna have to do this one at a time because I do have a bunch of different things. All right, so first off, uh, for people, so it's gonna be one, two, three, four. Uh, four times nine is gonna be 36. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, times 30 is 58. Um, I'm gonna have to move stuff over over here. All right, I'm next. It's gonna be the green production. So one, two, three, four. So it's going to be four times nine. Again, another 36, uh, 36. So let's go one, two, three, four, five, six plus 30 is 94, which is here. So that takes care of the great. And this is where I'm going to score a bulk of my points because I was collecting all the building ones. So it's going to be three, four, five, six, seven, eight times the number of buildings I have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's 56 points just on buildings. So six uh, here and then 50 something, blah, blah. And it doesn't really matter. I kind of destroyed them. I ended up with 256 uh, to yellows, 218 to greens, uh, measly uh, 185. <laughs> all right, so uh, there you go. We were all doing our separate little things. Green was collecting. Oh. And I was supposed to score one, two, three, four, five, six more. So let's just say I'm over here somewhere. Uh, doesn't really matter. So green was collecting the icons from the cards. Uh, yellow was just getting a ton of tools. And they didn't, they didn't actually get that many workers in the game, which is fine. Uh, I've seen people win without getting all the workers. And red just basically got all the other bonus cards, which you shouldn't let one player do. Uh, but it's hard in a three-player game. 
All right, so there you go. That was Stone Age. Uh, let me know if I made any mistakes. It's a pretty good entry level game, pretty easy to understand, easy to go through it. There's a bit of luck thrown in so that it's uh, it evens out the playing field, even if you're a great player at uh, worker placement games, if you play with somebody less, uh, uh, less uh, skill level, then uh, it, it gives you a fighting chance. All right, so uh, there you go. We'll see you in the next one later.